Whoa! Look at all the pumpkins, there's so many, they're even bigger and smaller ones. I'm so happy that we're here to pick out a pumpkin to make a jack-o'-lantern for Halloween. Let's go look around the patch. I pick the white pumpkin. That's a sweet size pumpkin you pick out there, Leah. You're right, this will make good jack-o'-lantern to put on my balcony at my apartment. Cool. Have you picked out a pumpkin yet, Camila? Nah, I'm still looking. I can't find the right one for me. Take your time. There's plenty of them for you to choose. Hi, Bobo. Hi, Ivy. Oh, mine. Look at those monkeys. Who are they, Leah? This Bobo and Ivy. They're both my colleague Courtney's pet monkeys. I met them before they're really kind animals. I see. They're so cute. Oh, you're such a cute a little monkey. Are you both here to pick out a pumpkin too? <laughs> oh, I see. Same with us too. But my friend Camila is still looking low. <laughs> I love monkeys. They're very adorable animals. Bobo, Ivy, we're done picking out a pumpkin and we're about to go to the checking stand to pay it. Come on. Alrighty then, I guess I'll see why later. Bye Bobo and Ivy. Come on Camila, let's go find a perfect pumpkin for you. Yeah, let's go. That's it guys, scoop all the pumpkin goop. Ivy you can draw the face. All the pumpkin goop is out. You can draw the face, Ivy. Good. Since you both done scooping up the goop and drew the face, I'll cut out the face and place a candle. There we go. Our jack-o'-lantern is finished. Great jack-o'-lantern, guys. Thanks, Hina. We decide to place our jack-o'-lantern at our front side of doorstep. Sounds good, the neighbors would apply to see it. I'm going to show Courtney, Sweet Pea, and Mariah. Hey Han, check out our jack-o'-lantern. The buy is done. Boy, that fun looks good. Thanks, I picked the best pumpkin to make this. But see, I can't wait to it. Hold on Mariah, we can't eat the pie yet, that's for later after we have dinner. Oh man. Hey guys. What is it Timothy? Check out the jack-o'-lantern that me and the monkeys made together. Oh, wow. That's a really great jack-o'-lantern you three made. I agree with Courtney. Thanks. By the way, that pie smells good. Thanks. I made with the second pumpkin I got from the patch. I see. We'll have it later after we have dinner. Great. I can't wait. I'll go put our jack-o'-lantern in front of our doorstep. Alright, Han. Alright Bobo, it's time for me to tuck you in. Before I do, I need to change into my pajamas. You go on ahead to bed and I'll be okay. Huh? What is that? Is that a hidden camera? I didn't notice it there before. Pitch me. Oh god, don't tell me someone place it there so they can see me naked while I was taking a shower. I need to tell Timothy. Timothy, get over here. What is it, Courtney? Why you look frightened? There are a hidden camera in our bathroom. Huh, a hidden camera. What the hell? I didn't notice it before. How did that get there? I don't know, but some, some creep place it there see me naked. I'm completely creep out about it. It's okay, Hong. We'll find out who's the culprit who's been filming you naked. I think is best for you if you should go to your parents' house tomorrow. In the meanwhile, I'll look for evidences that lead to the culprit. Um, alright, you're right. I'll do that tomorrow. I'll leave that to you, Han. I'll go tuck Bobo in. That bastard, filming my wife while she was naked. That freaking pervert. When I find out who filming her, I'll give him a piece of my mind. Damn it. That bastard took off my hidden camera, now I won't able to see Courtney's taking shower anymore, god damn it. No matter, I place another hidden camera in their closet. 
Courtney always change her clothes there, I would see her body then.